part of Police Scotland's ongoing endeavours to reduce the number of drug-related deaths across Scotland. And following on from Operation Fundamental in Dundee, Operation Threshold was incepted five months ago in Edinburgh. The most recent official figures show that there were 934 drug-related deaths in Scotland in 2017, of which 9% or 84 were in Edinburgh. We've been working closely with partners and developing intelligence both on drug dealers but also on the most vulnerable people in the community to more assertively and robustly direct them to support services to endeavour to help them make positive life choices ultimately with the aim of saving their own lives. Operation Threshold is drawn on resources from across Police Scotland and there was an initial intelligence gathering phase, a covert activity but since January there's also been a host of enforcement activity which thus far has seen us recover in excess of £1.2 million worth of drugs, a quarter of a million pounds worth of cash searched in excess of 100 houses. There have been 61 persons arrested on straight apprehension warrants related to Operation Threshold and a number of persons identi identified as being extremely vulnerable, sometimes through ambulance service information whereby they have been subject to CPR or administration of naloxone to save their lives and we've been targeting these people using partners in the Violence Offender Watch and with Aid and Abet to, as I said previously, robustly direct them to support services. We've had 65 such referrals and a further eight are works in progress currently. This week in Edinburgh is the culmination of the enforcement activity and we've got three days of intense activity with 31 Misuse of Drugs Act warrants to execute across the city. This will build on the figures that, uh, in terms of drugs and cash that we've recovered thus far in Operation Threshold uh, and will send a strong message um, to the drug dealing criminal fraternity across Edinburgh that we are absolutely committed to tackling them and removing illegal substances from the streets and charging and reporting to the courts the drug dealers. Partners are involved in these three days of action, not least of all from the City of Edinburgh Council, the NHS Lothian and the Third Sector with direct access through the, the MAC, the Multi-Agency Coordination Centre um, for those in need of urgent referral to support services. Also all those arrested will be uh, triaged via the custody nurses at St Leonard's Police Station or other arrest centres to ensure that they too can be directed to support services as required. In the medium to long term, the plan is to secure funding from Scottish Government and the Edinburgh and Alcohol Drug Partnership to secure assertive outreach nurses, sorry, assertive outreach workers and nurses um, to be placed within each of the four locality structures across Edinburgh so that the work that the police have been doing thus far in conjunction with the partners in building that intelligence picture of the most vulnerable will be taken forward in the medium to long term, ultimately with a view to making a positive impact on the number of drug-related deaths in Edinburgh.